Thanks for stopping by for another video, and if any, you're welcome. My name is Stephanie, and for today's video, I am planning in my Owl Paper Call journal, and I'm going to be using this beautiful cave from Pleasantly Planned. I also have these quotes from Martina's sticker company, and of course, I have my Simply Smith script stickers. All of the shops will be linked down in the description box below, so you guys can check them out and possibly even save some money on your order. So let's go ahead and move this one off to the side, and look at how beautiful this kit is. This is definitely definitely an older kit but I just thought that the colors were so perfect and just simply perfect to like end those summer spreads and start those fall spreads as well so yeah I love this kit and I actually have the regular sticker paper and the large one but she did just recently switch over to just having the regular sticker paper so definitely keep that in mind I cannot wait for my fall stickers to arrive so when you guys shop be sure to use Code Stephanie 10 to save on your order. And then I did just end up receiving my new Owl Paper Co. journals. And I cannot wait to show you guys because I just picked like the perfect little combination. So definitely stay tuned for that. And I did want to give you a little update of how I have been using my planner because right from the beginning, I said that I wasn't the best at journaling day-to-day -day, just kind of what was going on for the day something that stood out I know that I struggle with that and here we are again I am struggling again so I am now kind of using this as somewhere to kind of just jot down anything that sticks out to me whether it's affirmations or quotes, whether they're sassy, whether they're funny or something that I resonate with. And actually these ones for Martina Sticker Company are exactly what I'm talking about. I hope you heal from the things you don't talk about. Everyone has a chapter they don't read out loud. This comeback is personal. It's an apology to myself. So kind of cold like this, definitely stick out to me and what I've been doing is taking a screenshot or saving them but I have found the perfect way to kind of jot those down and so that is exactly what I have been doing in this weekly view so I cannot wait to do a fill up through to show you guys how everything has been coming along so that's just a little update now let's go ahead and start decorating these pages so I love the big stickers to kind of fill up the area really really well especially because we do have this space right here at the bottom and I think that the bigger stickers are really perfect for it so I'm gonna go ahead and grab these ones and I feel like the clear stickers are better here in my journal I just love the way that they look so I am trying to be careful because like I said this is an older kit and I have used it before um, but I just have so many repeats especially when I find one that I really really like so I am gonna try to kind of make this a little corner sticker and I feel like that's perfect right there. And then I think that I might want to put maybe like another one over here. Because I am actually planning to kind of put the quote right here in the middle. And I want another flower right over here. So did I want to use maybe this one? I think we're going to go ahead and stick with this one. I mean, I don't know if I jinx myself when I mentioned that I wasn't the best at like journaling, but it is just reality. I don't know what it is. I cannot seem to stick to it, but I feel like I have found the perfect way because like I said, I am always scrolling and these affirmations and just quotes um, just kind of call my name and some I resonate with and some I just think are funny just depending on what it is and yeah this is the perfect way to kind of save those instead of like on my phone because yeah my memory is gonna get full really really quick and so I think that this is just a better way of using my um my journal so let's see okay 
And actually, Brandy is using it as a wellness planner. And the way that she set it up is so good. So I'll go ahead and link her um, YouTube channel and her Instagram down in the description box so you guys can check her out to kind of see how she is using her um, our paper journal and then I'll go ahead and link Kelly's video as well she is kind of the one that got me started with this beautiful planner so she is just doing amazing things over there on her on her page and on her channel so I'll go ahead and link her information down below and all I'm gonna do is grab this quote and yeah right here like in the middle so i am gonna go ahead and lay this down first and then what i actually need to do is kind of tuck it here on the spine before i have it laid down over here okay so yeah i'm definitely still getting used to um using a book bound planner there's just things that I can't do because I can't take off the pages so yeah I think that looks amazing so now I just want to use these little little boxes to kind of fill up some of these squares so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right there and then I don't know did I want to do maybe one here and here I mean, why not? Let's go ahead and put that one right there. And then we'll go ahead and use this one. Oh, and actually, I don't even think I mentioned that I'm also going to be using a PT team. And actually, this one is Wrong Wrongs. And look at the beautiful flowers. I just thought that the colors went so well. So I'm going to be sprinkling some of these butterflies here. So I cannot believe I forgot. It was kind of off to the side over here. So I think that's, that's what ended up happening. So let's see. I don't know what I want to do over here. Uh, so here we used one for every for every day I don't think that I want to do the same thing over here unless unless I do and just see how it works um, but I don't know I don't think that I want to necessarily assign it to a specific day like maybe this one could go right there and then maybe I can cluster these two together. Um, yeah, so maybe something like that. And then let's see. Maybe or maybe we can do something like this. Okay, so essentially it's kind of like the same thing, right? These are just separated, and these are kind of, um, what is it, um, overlapping just a little bit. Okay, so I'm not too mad about it. So now I do want to use these smaller stickers to pair them with one of these boxes. So the bigger stickers are essentially to kind of fill up the area, which I think went really well down here. But these smaller stickers are more for um, adding a little bit of decoration. So maybe, maybe this one could go up here. Um, let's see, or maybe even here to kind of kind of be in between all of these okay perfect so now now let's see about maybe adding something up here or maybe oh yeah maybe we could cut this sticker maybe straight and then have it just be like right here okay I think I am really loving that idea so let's let's try and get this just trying to be extra extra careful oh my gosh okay there we go so um i think that i want to use 
most of it so maybe we can trim down just a little bit to kind of give us that straight edge so i think i'm gonna just go ahead and flip it so it's a little bit easier for me to see okay so there we go oh my gosh i think this is turning out so cute and i haven't even added the small little touches so maybe we could actually have another straight edge sticker kind of coming out this way and maybe this time it could be just a small sticker so um it doesn't take away from um what we just created down at the bottom and then as far as the daily pages i feel like that one i believe i did say how i was using that and it's just to kind of jot down song lyrics um so i'll go ahead and decorate it and then just whatever i am listening to or again whatever just resonates with me a lot of things have been resonating with me lately and it's just just things that i'm currently going through and that's why i feel like this is the perfect way to kind of get everything on paper but without actually writing specific details if that makes any sense okay so i love this right here let me go ahead and add these ones to all of the boxes that way it's looking a little bit more complete so we are simply going to add these today once and actually i was looking for ones that i have that say important or remember not necessarily like today but i couldn't find those so this is what we're working with but yeah i definitely need to use other headers but for now these are perfect so there is that and then one more right over here okay perfect so yeah so far so good i think that what i want to do now is add um yeah let's start adding some of these butterflies so i was thinking of having some butterflies kind of going up the page like that so let's go ahead and grab this and some are going to be going off of the page and i love putting stickers off of the page i think it looks so pretty so i think that one looks amazing did i maybe want to do this one Mm, it has like yellows in there um okay what about this one this one has uh, some purple so i want to stick to the purple theme so maybe this one could go right there and then i do have to add some cute little trails and oh my gosh look at how big this one is um let's see so we do have this one i am looking for like those purples and greens so as far as this one maybe this one could go here again just off of the page a little bit um, let me see oh here's a small little one and i feel like this one would go so well like right over here did I want to do it that way or this way? Um, that's a good question. Um, or did I want to go down here? No, right over here to kind of fill up that area. Okay, so now I think that looks amazing. If I find another one, maybe I could do it right here. Okay, so I think, did I want to do like these yellow ones? They're just like the perfect size. I actually didn't end up using this one so this one is gonna go right there wow that looks amazing oh my gosh that looks so good and i think that i might be done with the butterflies i think that really like completed the spread it added that perfect little touch so let me go ahead and finish rolling this up before it's total madness here because i almost forgot that i wanted to use them i cannot believe that okay so let's see i do want to add 
those trails. So let me just see what pens I have here. I was just recently cleaning um, my area because it was getting super duper messy. Okay, oops, I'm sorry if I just shook that. Okay, so the trails could maybe do something like this. And how about this one? It could maybe do a little loop-de-loop -loop and kind of get lost right there. And then this one, maybe this one could come off right over here. And again, a quick little loop-de-loop, -loop. not as well as it should be, but we are going to go with it. So maybe this one could do something like that. And then we can go ahead and do the very last one like that. Okay. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. So now let's just quickly get rid of everything that's hanging off of the page. I just love when I have stickers that go off of the page. I just think it looks so pretty. Okay, so there we go. Now, let's go ahead and see it all put together. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. Let me let me go ahead and show you. I'm just trying to get rid of that so we can see it a little bit better. But look at the way that it turned out. I think it looks amazing. Thank goodness that I did not forget that I wanted to add those cute butterflies. I think it all looks so good. And... Yeah, I cannot wait to kind of fill it in and don't forget to come back once I get my life together because it has been crazy busy over here. So I am just trying to stay up to date and not fall behind. So yeah, be sure to be on the lookout for that video. But for now, I am obsessed with the way that this turned out. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing. And don't forget to check me over on Instagram at Stephanie Happily Plants. And I'll see you next time.